What is up guys, Austin Richo here, back again playing Ark Survival Evolved on the Ragnarok server. Sitting here at my castle as you saw last time. Um, I don't know. There we go. I was like, I can't remember how to get a better chair. So as you can see, I did do some update and I still have this, this chair. I need to figure out something to do with it different. But I did get colors chosen, so I just did some research online and just saw that like yellow and red were like some of the most popular colors for, you know, like kings and stuff and to represent kingdoms and everything. So I did a yellow and red uh, multi pattern. I forgot to get a uh, T Rex head or something to put there in that uh, spot there to hang over the chair and stuff. I completely forgot about it, but I did get some torches up some light there so I put those two there there's one up here on the outside there as you can see and then if we come around back downstairs I still did not decorate the kitchen and stuff just haven't had time put two on the front there and then there's two on the front out there Let's see if we can fly around and I did put flags up in these corners as well so if you look you can see the uh, flags and then there's a light there as well and so that's pretty much all I've gotten done I haven't been able to do any more updates like I said to furnish the uh, castle or whatever and I just want to say just um, not that it really matters but just to say so in the last episode I kept calling this a keep because I know a keep is a part in, of a castle and everything but when editing the video I was like I wonder if I'm even saying the right thing so I looked it up and found out that, that what I've would call this is actually or would be more like the great hall and so that's why the last video was labeled that way and not the keep that I kept calling it and so I kept saying that wrong and so now today I want to start working on the stables so we're gonna do some horse stables over here and I did not think about exactly what I want to do with this I hope I have enough material stuff I did uh, get a red blueprint because I had to fly back to the base to make the paint and everything and there's a red drop and I got this blueprint for a long neck rifle pretty good one too that I need to make sometime so yeah I definitely need to pull in wood and I feel like I've got stuff like I've filled my things up oh yeah so we're doing good on all that okay so let's go in here and we will don't know exactly what I want to build this off of uh, let's go in here and do some wood foundations we'll go with like 20 or something for now I don't know exactly how I want to do this because I thought about just putting it on the ground but then I don't know if that's exactly what I want to do or not I can't decide I'll probably have to move this door also which will be fine but over here is where I'm gonna make like the animal area so over here pretty much starting here I'll put I'm gonna need a lot more foundations than what I thought but I'm going to make a horse stable let's go ahead and craft up some more we'll just do another 20 and then let's see do I have anything else I brought some compost bins over so I can use those railings which I will be using I don't have anything in here I can use to build with currently which kind of stinks but oh goodness I'm dehydrated I get so dehydrated over here I don't know why um, but yes we got our horses let's go ahead and I guess move them out of the way just stick them over here somewhere But we're gonna make it where there's multiple horse stables and I have to test out the horses to see like what kind of areas they fit into like if they can fit in a one by one or if it has to be something bigger not exactly sure but let's run back over here I still probably don't have enough foundations now that I think about it so we do have the 20 so far okay let's run back over here I want to start right here we can go ahead and leave that door there for now
Okay, so there's issue. I want this to be completely flat. So I'm going to have to start, I guess, doing that. I hate it being that tall, though. That's the only issue I really have. I think we'll go out one more, maybe. Like I said, I need to test it first with a horse. There we got ten more. I was going to say, this may be pretty close. Do you know how many we need in every how many uh, foundations I need but then like of course the whole underground part is what sucks that should be fine and we'll do another row and I would like to kind of go that way a little bit too so I, that last amount should be enough come on I got a new keyboard and I keep hitting all the wrong buttons is this still not done nine I feel that's a weird amount but should be correct though yeah we're gonna need more because since this will probably be the front yeah so I need at least two more two three more maybe Again, that's even if the horses fit how I'm wanting to, them to fit. So we'll just go ahead and do another uh, 20. Um, maybe we'll do 10. Or craft 10. There we go. Get those. And I think, do I have any ramps? ceiling with that so we have a stone ramp I can go ahead and just use one of those for now just to use to get the horses up and down to test out let's check in here I think I moved all the building stuff out but you never know yeah just the electrical boxes are left in there okay so then we'll also grab I only have three railings what am I doing Okay, let's go ahead and put the stone there in the railings let's just do it up here somewhere where it'll be able to touch the ground that's good enough come here unicorn you're the test horse oh goodness shoot is this wide enough because I want it to be Okay, so this looks like it will work. I just don't know, say, if I can trust it very well. Okay, so I do need to be out to... I want it to be a two. Then, okay, I definitely need a lot more ceilings than what I thought for this to work. Okay, so there's ten more. We'll go ahead and just do another twenty. So like I said, not exactly what I was hoping for, but we'll make it work. See, I'm going to have to do all of this now. Pick up that one. And hopefully that will be closer at least let's get another tin then let's go ahead and do some more railing just so I can have them being prepared yeah we'll just do the 100 just because I'll be using them for a lot of different things coming up that I have planned for okay we got 11 good enough 
See, that's saying I just don't like how high this is, but for it to lay out how I want it to, it's going to have to be high like that. Okay. Let's see if this is good enough now. Okay, so if we do two, and then there should be two over here. One, two. And that leaves, I think, one. Is it one? I can't tell. I can't see this. So I have one, two, three, four, five. So I'll leave a, a center row. Um, I think that will be fine. I don't know. Do I need to do it out one more? Maybe we'll do one. <laughs> I don't want to make that many. But I'm trying to get this to look pretty decent. Because, you know, there's not going to be much stuff in this castle area, so it's... You know, doesn't really mean too much. Yeah, it's gonna be a while. We'll do another tin. And that hopefully will be enough for now at least. I just realized this size difference in these two. Okay, let's pick this up. Whoops, there we go. There we go, now it fits a lot better. doesn't fit perfectly but it's gonna have to do okay and I'm obviously not gonna place that there let's see how wide across is this so we have one two three four five six seven eight nine okay cuz we'll want it centered let's jump over that go ahead and start grabbing those at least Oops. So I think I will go ahead and leave this door here just to make it kind of like, you know, a secret door area. Then we'll come all the way over here and I keep hitting the wrong button. Okay, and I'm going to try and keep them all to the outside edge like that. There we go. And then that should be, you know, a horse stable on each one. And then if we leave a space of two, so then one, two. So again, do the outside edge there. Kind of like that, then we'll leave a space. Of two, and then we'll do this side. That's 
one, two, three, one, two, three, four. I feel it should probably be, <laughs> I should probably center this more. So let's maybe place it on that side and pick this one up. So one, two, three, four, one, two, three, and possibly a fourth one there, depending on how I design this. Let's go see what's done now. This isn't going to be a very exciting build. Um, actually, I should probably f just finish this off. And... Gosh, I don't like how tall this is. Place up there. There we go. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So yeah, it's an off number. Okay, I don't know. <laughs> Let's go with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so we all want tooth. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know exactly how I want to do this. Let's go ahead and run over here real quick and make some wood ramps. do two real quick and then I'm probably gonna have to just play around with this and get the design down and so pretty much I'll probably just have to build most of it all off screen just so I can try and figure this all out which would be nice to build this whole thing but since I don't know exactly how I want to do this Let's, let's get the horse. So obviously it can, yeah, it can fit right down there, which is not too bad. And then it can have all the room there. Okay, so I may go with this. I have to replace those. Just to get them to fit and line up. Do this real quick. Replace them. There we go. Okay, so it's not perfect in exactly how I was wanting. But now we have at least enough stable areas for quite a bit of horses. And then I'm just going to kind of play around with the design. And I may leave this one open if I do ex decide to extend out that way some more. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to just make sure if I do, I'll just go ahead and put it out over here. So anyways, I'm going to finish doing this and then I'm going to you know, build up and put a roof on this place. It's going to be a thatch roof similar to you know that one and everything so nothing too fancy and I may play around with some decorations and everything to try and just make it look more like a horse stable and everything so I will build on that and bring it back probably at the end to show you what it looks like at the finish but it's just going to be you know this kind of design and everything so I will bring it back once I'm done so you'll see what it looks like so I'll see you then Okay, so I think I've got everything complete now. So as you can see, we've got the barn all set up here. And now I'm going through just adding these double doors on. I wish they were a little bit taller, but um, putting the doors, you know, 
all the way up like normal is way too tall but I'm gonna show you what I do I'm I did not like come up with this I saw it on YouTube video a while ago and I don't remember who it was or anything but I'm definitely not taking credit for this I was shown this so you just put down a railing and then place a ceiling on top and you have to have the no foundations required so the ceiling just kind of floats there I'm pretty sure I showed this already but just for like new people and then you just toggle through until the gate is down with the little arrow you know pointing forward towards you and you place it then you just pick up the ceiling and then I'm just currently putting like two usually I would just leave it but because of I did the two high um, railings of wood I went ahead and just added in another railing because it fits in on top there so then you can obviously come through and add all of the double doors and you'll just have to toggle them till they're short oops I'm hitting the wrong button again like that and so then it adds the half door frames so it looks pretty cool in that way Let's see if I can get them all down in here and then we'll add some other decorations to the barn here like I said this isn't exactly what I was wanting I probably could have just done a one wide here but I went ahead and did the two and then it's a lot higher up like from the ground than what I want I want it to be you know all like this level maybe but because of the ground you know I mean in relatively in relativity or whatever you call it to the ground I want it to be like that far off the ground not you know this high but because the way this ground is laid out and to try and get a flat because I wanted it you know as flat as possible I just you know did what I could do type thing there we go and the last door here is added in and then we can go in now and I have thatch ceilings to place down so just to you know make it be like the horses are sleeping on or standing on hay and stuff not just the wood ground so just add some more aesthetic and detail into again not perfect but I think it looks pretty good this way and then with the wood floor of course it you know helps set the barn apart or the different parts areas apart I guess you could say like that and we're almost done here and the last one of course I went ahead and got the unicorn put in just as the test of one make sure they would even fit in you know like the one white area and stuff and I think it looks pretty dang good the only issue is with uh the walking of the horses and everything so um, I'll just obviously show you I'll just go ahead and put it in this last is the whole doors don't work too well and I've never had it stuck which is kind of weird I'm um, usually the unicorn would just walk right over the door <laughs> that's the thing but if you stand back and do it okay so if you get to like a certain area I don't know maybe I can't do it now or something I was able to you know hit E and the door would open but so it's not perfect like that so they just walked over but it still looks pretty cool at least so we got it all figured out I don't like the ceiling but obviously you can't do like non ceilings like I would have to leave an edge or something and I just I don't like the all solid wood but you know it's just the design that it is but I think that's probably gonna be it for today I'm trying to decide though if I want to end up throwing jump horsey <laughs> there we go and then we'll just stick the horse I like this blue color horse a lot I'll have to get a feeder put in here for him and everything but it just looks cool I'm trying to decide if like up here I just want to you know for the aesthetic to put uh, the thatch in there to make it look like hay and everything not exactly sure and then I'm gonna put some torches and stuff because I you know did put torches up on the uh, whatever a great hall I can remember what I called it and everything of course as I think I showed earlier but yeah I think that's gonna be it for the horse stable for today now I just will build a sheep area because I like I said I want to do kind of like the farm animals oh goodness oh look out <laughs> that was shot out that was pretty funny um yeah, I'm gonna want to do like you know farm related animals so we have horses and then of course the sheep which I just need to get the veggie cakes which I'm having a hard time getting honey 
because it's taking forever to produce so I don't know exactly what to do for that but um, probably over here then I'll just you know I want them on the flat ground so I'll just put some railings down in a some sort of design and pattern and put the sheep in there to wander around but the horses you know need a nice stable to live in and everything so I got the horse stable and it looks pretty cool um, the ground part I don't know about the up top and everything else but you know I don't know what else to do and what else aesthetically I could add to it or anything not exactly sure but I think it looks you know pretty decent like I said too high up off the ground compared to what I wanted but it still looks pretty dang cool and I really like this so that is probably going to be it for this episode today so I hope you enjoyed be sure to let me know if you did by leaving a thumbs up and leave any comments you have for me in the video or in the comments I guess area down below and don't forget to subscribe to see more arc videos and continuing to build up the castle I gotta start you know doing resource related stuff um at some point you know getting like the blacksmith and everything all set up but i thank you for watching and we will see you next time